everyone and welcome back to Hitman Blood Money. Today we're doing the wonderful mission Flatline. Actually no, his name is just 47, not 472. That'd be ridiculous. Triple digits? Come on. Yeah, what's the big deal about a guy who murders other people? Usually, you know, people who are like high up in the military and like corporate espionage and like you know the most powerful people in the world he just murders um what's the big deal with that I don't know if we're quite to the point where we can get to the genetic modification and cloning perfected into one setup, you know? Actually, uh, he's not serious. His name is Jack. Hmm, too dangerous. One above, one dangerous. All right. Ooh, March 31st, 2004, the last day of the month. Father, I'm here for confession. I have gravely sinned. Oh, you're not father, you're a woman. What type of mole? You know, a lot of people just call them beauty marks. Just like the mighty grizzly bear. Alright. Alright, well, go make a man kind of dead, but not actually dead. I can do that, maybe. Agent Smith. He looks like me, if I did start drinking. 47, not me personally. No, I guess he kind of does, but you know, not fully. Alright. So what do I remember about this mission? Not a lot. However, I do remember one thing. It's much easier to get around in this place if I'm disguised as someone who's interested in... Oh, nope, 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 nope. Sedative, all right. Oh, fudge butter, oh come on. Sometimes it's so finicky with whether or not it will actually let me uh, knock someone out.
If I was, you know, really sloppy, I'd just murder this man. Don't mind me, sir. Clark Kent looking, uh, sucker. Alright. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Up. Oh. Dang it. Dag it, Bobby. Alright. Well. No. No, no, no. I can't do that yet. Oh. Alright. Dang it! So mad. Alright. Also, my audio seems to be desynced. At least it's it's desynced on my side, so there's not a lot we can do on it. If it's desynced between the, uh... Between the, well, between the microphone and me... I might be able to do something, I'm not sure, uh, but no, I think when it's like this, there's not a lot I can do with it. Alright, M. Okay. Um, they're going up. Alright, I think this is the first step, and I'm sure I'm doing it wrong. Alright. Of course, no. Guys, this is the first step, and it's a little difficult to do sometimes. Because I'm doing it wrong mostly, but whatever. I don't know how to do it right, which is why I'm not doing it right. But... No. No. Hello. Stop, please, please stop. Please stop, no, please stop. Um, how do I do this without getting caught, like, immediately? Nope, I think I need to wait for that guard to pass. Goodness gracious, this is, um, this is by far my least favorite part of the mission. No, wait. I'm pretty sure... No, no, no. I'm pretty sure I'm doing this all wrong. No, not all wrong. Alright. I needed to do that also. Admissions papers are necessary for, uh... Oh, yeah. Hmm. I need to hide my silver baller also, because they're gonna search me. Nope, can't be right here. Let's make it right behind this giant tree. then they'll just take me in because I have these admissions papers really hope they don't find my gun and confiscate it alright Mm 
Mm-hmm. Hello. I would like to be admitted. Welcome. You'll be staying in room A. Just yes. step into the dressing room, change into a robe, and leave your clothes and personal effects for safekeeping. Okay. No problem. Please, like, I'd like some privacy. I mean, come on. I know this is a hospital and all, but... Can't go around just staring at me while I change. Hello. Gonna have to search you, sir. Alright. Go ahead and search. Thanks. You're all set. Thank you. Oh, that's exactly where I came from. Alright. So now we can actually get to the point where we're actually doing things on this mission. Step one, a guard's outfit, of course. Pretty standard procedure, really. Um, but also, let's see here. May as well, you know, just poison random things. It's not like I know, uh, you know, who all needs to die in this mission. It's not like I have some sort of precognition knowledge. There are actually, uh, I think two optional targets in this mission. Oh. No problem. Feel free to let there be trouble and make it double. Uh, let's see here. Hello. I suppose this is just a place where people hang out. Hmm. Uh, to say I remember all of the... Ooh. Oofta. All of the little minute pieces of this map is incorrect. Much like most of the maps, I only kind of half remember them. Nope. I have not. I have not seen him. Uh. Hmm. That's a man. This is a hot tub. Man, I really don't remember where I'm going. That being said, I'm totally fine with these episodes being like half I'm completely lost and failing. And the other half of these episodes, uh, being me actually doing anything competent. Hi there. I really kind of like it that way. You guys may hate it, but that's okay. Because I hate you. I'm just kidding, I don't hate all of you. Some of you guys are pretty great. Some of you guys smell like farts. You know who you are. Oh, dang it. You know, you know, you know. It could be beautiful. Oh. Here he goes. Drinking again. Let's watch him. Take a sip. Greg Thurman, I'm the on-call therapist. A lot of the clients here find it helpful to have someone to talk to. I'm always available if you need an ear. Just drop by my office. If I'm not in, there's always at least one. Okay. No problem, therapist man. I was just watching this man die. What does that say to you about me? Oh, my. No. Chum Lee, ouch. He's the worst Pawn Star. You know, you know, you know. I don't even know if I'm supposed to kill this person, but I figure why not, right? Uh, 
Uh oh. My detection meter's at red. That's no good. Hmm. Al, please stop. Hmm. Okay. I get it now. I'm not supposed to murder you guys. Okay. Once more from the top. I promise I'll start saving my game now. Now that I remember kind of how this is supposed to go. You know, you know, this is the way it's supposed to go. What? Don't at me. You ever wonder what it would be like to be bald? I just had a bunch of hair cut off recently, so I'm not too far from it myself. Uh, for reference, it was at a three, which is usually an inch and a half in length, I think. Um, no, wait, it can't be that much. Um, I don't know. What is a three on clippers? Just turn around, both of you. Ah, uh, this won't work if literally... Oh, no. I'm not trying to kill myself, after all. Turn around, please. Everyone. Man, I wish I was drinking. I made the decision not to buy any alcohol today. Let's see if I make that same decision tomorrow. The answer's probably gonna be no. It's okay. I'm a little bit better at commentary while I'm drunk. Sometimes. Okay, no. Seriously? Two of you? Wow. That's really annoying. Um, let's, let's scout the grounds from the outside. So here, there's that guy, there's that guy. Okay. I think I know what I need to do. You, well, first of all, I need these guards to go away. I need this guy to stop turning around. Do you ever just have, like, an, an intrusive thought? Like, you know, one where you think about doing something really horrible, but then not... But then you don't, because, you know, of how it would affect your life. Dude, you're killing me. You're killing me, Smalls. Yeah, whatever, alright? I don't care about your drinking problem. You're not even real. Much like me. That's why I don't care about my drinking problem. Which is to say, I didn't get myself a nice cup of ice water before starting this episode. Which I will rectify before next episode, which I will also be probably doing soon. There you go. Thank you. Yes, I will. You know what, I'm going to do the smart thing and close this door before I just haphazardly drop my gun on the ground. If I don't do this, they'll catch me. Like, right away, they'll be like, oh, hey, what's that? What's that metal thing in your pocket? Oh, it's a, it's a gun. Alright, go ahead and do it. I bet you won't. Bet you won't even uh, ch check my butt. Yeah. I thought you wouldn't check my butt. Let's not metagame it this time. Let's actually do, do things in the proper order. You know, you know, you know. Hey, you got no business here. 
I'm sorry. I apologize. Hmm. What? I'm just looking around. God. Some people are just so suspicious of other people. Untrust... What's the word for not believing people are trustworthy? Untrustworthy isn't the word, because that's the one where you're not worthy of receiving trust. What's a person who's stingy with their trust? Suspicious? No. Um... Oh, hey. Um... I don't know why this man is making, like, three different pots of spaghetti. Or at the very minimum, just the sauce. No ketchup. Um, no, please don't catch me. I would hate for my viewers to see the entire beginning all over again. Okay. First things first, we're gonna save. Because we made it to the first of our main objectives. A security guard's outfit. A better outfit is something you need for almost every Hitman game, for almost every level. Come on, in the dumpster with you. Alright. Alright, now what do we do? Well, we always steal the videotape, we don't want those going around. Um, let's see here. Space. Uh, space. Make sure to pick up some pistols. Some submachine guns what type of place is this um, I don't think submachine guns are normal at a rehab facility I haven't been to a rehab facility yet part of me wants to stick around just to see who comes by to fix it but I also don't care Oh, there's a key card. All right. Now what do we do with a drunken sailor? I'll pick that lock. All right. Pick that lock. What? Is there a problem, sir? Hmm, okay. So, despite the fact they saw me come in here just a few minutes before, they're not going to notice anything different about me. It's going to look totally normal to them. I could also walk around with my gun out. We always pick our silver baller back up because silver baller is a very good gun but I don't want to risk it because sometimes when people see me with a gun out um, yeah whatever I don't care um, what were my objectives again oh here we go um, find agent, identify agent, smuggle out agent, escape Alright, that's B on the old keyboard and mouse. I know where the agent is. The agent's downstairs. Uh, now to find the downstairs. Oh, hello. Alright, downstairs. Oh, what's this? Hello. Um... <laughs> this is a book. 
Like, I find it kind of weird that there's armed guards in this place at all. But it, I mean, it's a Hitman game, so there's probably some reason that people are armed. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Hello. Alright, so he's right here. Does he mind? Yes, he does. He minds. Uh, yeah. Okay. No problem. Alright, so that, to me, means... Logan! Alright, so that means that we're gonna have to load in some fun times, because if I goof this up, they're going to kind of be very mad at me. Maybe I'll toggle this life off. How does that make you feel? Oh yes, he foolishly cared about the lights. What an idiot. Okay. Alright. Alright, step one. There are two guys in this room. Uh, one, two. One goes in, he's coming in, he's turning around, he's looking around, he's looking in my direction. Should I be worried? Probably. I'm not sure though. Let's not worry about that right this second. He comes around, he looks, I think we can see him from there, here? We can. Okay, um, things could get really messy really quickly if I do this incorrectly. And also if 47 doesn't listen. Okay, 47. I'm sorry. Um,. Dang it. 47. I don't know what about it is like. Sometimes he just refuses to go through ledges or go through uh, windows and stuff. I wish I could get him to like more reliably uh, do what I wanted. Alright. Just go through the window. Come on. 47, you're not trying. No, 47. If you take out a gun, people are gonna think you... Oh, God. See, it's those moments of me fighting with the uh, windows and such that'll really put me away. Alright, suit orderly, drag, alright, okay come on, fast, 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 alright, okay, no one should know. Alright, um, cell key? Keycard rehab. Alright. Delightful. You don't know anything, right? Okay. Let's go down here. Very slowly. One, two, alright. Not him. No one, 
No one's in. Oh, dang it. All right. Yeah, talk. You. I should have known. Sedating me. Psychotropics. Oh, so it's not that he's drunk. It's that they've been sedating him. Figures. They'd send you to clean up my mess. Th this is the guy. Here. I'm getting you out of here. You'll never let me out alive. I know. All right. So as per usual, I have to work very quickly. No, please. How funny would it be if I just pulled out a gun and shot him in the head? I'd probably lose the mission for that. Oh, okay. I actually have to push E on him. I can't pull out the syringe and use it normally. Okay. Go go to sleep, buddy. Identity obtained. Executing rest of assignment. Splendid 47. It might interest you to know the following. A sudden shift in the delicate power balance of the New York families uh, this man's flatlining. Can we not do an entire phone conversation? Two members of the same group are currently staying at the facility. Terminating either will result in a fifty thousand dollar bonus per head. It's entirely up to you. Understood. Okay. Well, first things first. I need to get out of here. All right, that's close enough. All right, I just need to be out of this like room itself. Let's see here. I'm pretty sure the orderly suit will get me everywhere I need to be. Um, for the rest of the mission, actually. Uh, and now I think I have to kill like two, those two guys, one of which was the guy in the pink that I killed in my last life. Oh, he's gone. Alright, good. So now I just kind of have to hang around in this oh all right all right one and then the other one is that guy who works out both of these are very easy to accomplish uh, And I can do his right now. Oh, as long as he keeps working out. Uh oh. Dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. I should have checked. I got a little overly greedy. Alright, I'm gonna die. Once it goes into slow motion, you're dead. <sighs> Load game. The second one, I guess. This room. Alright. Alright, so let's do this a little bit faster and a little bit funnier. And by faster and funnier, I mean just like. Let's not screw up this time. Idiot. Alright. So I'm gonna have to wait for this to happen again. Let's see here, what time is it? Mm, it's probably around 30 minutes of video. I really don't want to split this into two episodes because I think I'm real close to cracking this nut. What 
a strange expression. I'm really close to cracking this nut. I mean, most nuts aren't even that hard to crack. Even a walnut, you know, just use a simple uh, lever system on it and it's going to go down like a bag of sand. Turn around and leave the office. Oh, all right. Okay, so he does it much more reliably when he goes through the, uh, uh I goofed that one up. Okay, guys, um, hmm, on-the-fly decision-making. I'm just gonna keep this as one episode unless I die again. If I die again, which I doubt. I'll just, uh... Is holding crouch all you gotta do? No. Crouch, stop. Then you go through the window. Alright. I don't need to use a poison. I just need to grab and move quickly enough that I don't get caught. You know, it's questionable whether or not me taking the time to close that door would help prevent or incur bigger problems. Keycard rehab, sell key. Alright. Easy as pie. Alright. So we're going to come back down here. I think it was the second one on the left. Yes, it was. You. I should have known. Sedating me. I don't care. How do I skip through this? Oh my gosh. I didn't ask for your life story, okay? I'm getting you out of here. I'm yeah. Out of my name is Agent 47. I don't want to be 47 by the time we're done talking, okay? All right. I might have to probably save it after this because I don't want to go through that dang conversation again. Identity obtained. Execute and this one. Yeah, there's a New York power balance. Who cares? It's New York. There's always a power balance. The delicate power balance of the New York families. Two low-level contracts just came in. In addition to your primary target, two members of the same group are currently staying at the facility. Terminating either will result in a $50,000 bonus per head. It's entirely up to you. Understood. I wonder if you actually dropped, like, uh... Not a dumbbell. Uh, a, just a, a racked weight, if that would actually, like, kill someone. Like, if you just dropped it straight on their trachea. I know someone's going to say something about throat muscles, but how muscular can your throat really get in comparison to, like, 200 pounds? Of just like, you know, force weighing down on your throat. I guess the likely answer is someone would say that it like kind of, like, you can make it slip off of you. Which I could believe. Um, oh yeah, I've got to save before I forget and or kill myself doing something silly. Uh, let's see here. close this um all right now we just wait in the well wait room 
Or we could just shoot him in the back of the head, I guess. Slash garrot him. It's not very elegant, but, I mean, it works. See, now we've got some extra people to kill. Kill... Wait, kill... Lorenz Lombardo? Oh yeah, that was the picture I got of the guy. Is it? Whatever. Who cares? Oh, maybe he's the pasta guy. Who knows? Hello. Kill, 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 kill. Man. It's really annoying that I can only uh, kill him during the times that they let me. I should be able to just, like, choke him out right now. I mean, I'm a pretty big dude. I, I'm not going to say whether or not I'm stronger than him or anything. Alright, run. Run quickly. I don't want to be anywhere near the body when it passes out, slash is dead forever. Has gone into a new world. Um, hmm. No, can't go that way because I don't want to be seen with the body. Sometimes the AI flips out and if you, they see you near a dead body, they automatically think you're the one who caused it. Which, you know, isn't that bad of AI, to be honest, because a lot of people react in a similar way. I know I would. If I see, you know, anyone standing above a dead body, I'm like, oh, well, he did it. You know, I'm not an investigator for this reason. Kind of would jump to the first assumption uh, of, oh, that explains this dead body really easily. Um... Let's see here. Uh, I need to find the patient rooms. I don't think they're on this side. Let me just see if I can... Uh, Alright, I'm right here. I think I need to go... Forward. And then... Maybe left? No. Oh, there's a second guy down. Let's check our objectives really quickly. Yep. Two men have been murdered so far. Uh, with a third, maybe a fourth on the way. Who knows? Um... I think I need to go this this way, and then through here, and then, no, not down, I need to go up. That's not up either. That's the lounge. Oh, I think this will work. I just have to mess with this one's gas meter. Oh, I don't know if I can. Uh, sometimes I get real lost in these levels. Not like lost in the figurative sense, like, oh wow, this is really amazing. Uh, sometimes that, but more so than just like, oh, here we go. Where the heck am I supposed to go? I know what I'm supposed to be doing, I just can't remember how to get there. Alright. I'm pretty sure it's now all just a uh, matter of waiting long enough to uh, collect that third kill. Um, 
One. Oh, that's the last guy. Alright, we did it. Now to make that one guy that we definitely didn't kill alive. Um, let's see here. Oh, he's just dragging that body around. It's really bad uh, for morale to just like drag an entirely dead body around a addiction clinic. That'd make me want to get a drink. And I'm not even, uh, you know, an alcoholic. Or a, you know, alcoholic that's trying to quit. Alright. So they've been moving these bodies. I don't know if they move all these bodies. I know they move uh, Agent Smith's body in to the morgue, but I'm trying to wonder. I want to know. Hmm. He watches the door. Hmm. Nope, no more poison. I have one more sedative. Wait, did I kill that last one of these guys? Oh, shucks. Uh-oh. Silver baller time. Uh-oh. Shit. That was unintentional. It's okay, though. Because we're out of here. Did I kill two extra people? Yeah. Wait, one? Maybe two. That's uh, okay. Just go. Come on. Wake up and get going. Don't make me regret my decision to make this only one episode. Get out of here, you Van Gogh looking lo loser. Let's go. Wait, let me just check. Yep, escape. Alright. I did it! All in one episode, too. Okay. Um, covers blown, one. Witnesses, two. Caught on camera, no. Oops. 15 out of 100. Contract killer, 23 minutes in total for the winning... Um, damage control, suit retrieval, okay. Um, 15 points is exactly what I need. Bribe civilians, okay. This is a meta kind of thing where people, like, people get more suspicious of you just, like, on site and on, uh, reputation. And you want to keep that at zero basically all the time. Unless you're, like, a wild man who wants to get wild with it. Um, but anyways, that's been, uh, Hitman Blood Money. We made it through that entire mission in one episode. Uh, that's pretty impressive. Um, remember guys, stay safe, have fun, don't get addicted to drugs, and, you know, end up in a, a rehab clinic. Uh, you know, it's just no fun if you ask me. And bye.